everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Davey and in today's video I am sharing with you how my husband and I are saving money on baby things. So I love thrifting and I use a lot of hand-me-down items and that is what I'm going to share with you. Some of the items that we are using that are thrifted and hand-me-down um, just to save on some expenses and costs and um, just be more frugal with our money. So I'm just going to jump right in and share what we are getting hand-me-down. The first thing is this breastfeeding pillow. These are mainly from my sister. So um, the brand here is My Best Friend and has a little strap there, cute color for a little girl. It's perfect. I have seven nieces and no nephews at all. So I'm getting a lot of hand-me-down girl stuff, which is perfect. I'm totally okay with that, not getting new items and products. All right, the second item I'm really excited about, especially for my husband to use, is this Ergo Baby, or Ergo Baby, however you say it, carrier. And this will be perfect. Um, my husband and I like to be pretty active, go for walks and hiking and stuff like that. So he can use it, um, I'll use it. I also wanna get a Moby Wrap and use that as well, but I know these are not cheap normally, so hand me down. I am just so grateful and thankful for being able to get some of these products. The next thing is, of course, it's cute little tummy time blanket that looks like a puppy. So um, this is just a teeny little thing that was from a boutique shop where my sister lives that she was given and it had only been used for one of her children. So it'll be really fun to have. I know the baby will all grow up pretty quickly because it's kind of small, but so cute and fun to have and something I wouldn't go buy and splurge on. So just kind of a fun little bonus thing to get. <laughs> all right. This one's a little bigger. So the next thing, of course, is this little bouncy chair. Um, my sister gave me this as well, and we did buy one at a thrift store to actually resell, but we didn't end up reselling it, so I have two. But I know these are great for when I'm like working in the kitchen, a living room or something, and I want baby in there. This will be really nice to have, and you know what, I don't care if there's a little bit of spit up on the straps to me. It doesn't matter if it looks worn or not. I mean, <clears throat> brand new things, get ruined anyway, so why spend a lot of money on them? Um, this is just a bumbo chair. I don't know if we'll use it or not, but it helps with a uh, baby sitting up. But this was also hand-me-down, and I think it'll be nice if I want our baby to work on her posture and sitting up a little better. That will be very nice and handy to have on the floor. Another thing that my sister is bringing for us are baby clothes, since I said she had all girls. She's handing me down some baby clothes to have for our baby girl. And um, of course I'll have to go through them and figure out what I wanna keep, what I wanna redonate, or what I wanna do with that. And also another thing is a like little walker bouncy chair. She um, said her kids are outgrown it and so she's gonna share that with me. This is the last item. It is um, a carrier for old hats and they're no longer old hats in them. There's just three boxes and they have such a cute floral pattern with a pink and blue flowers on it. I thought this would be fun storage for a little girl's room. I might not use it, I might. It matches the walls already that I painted. Um, if you follow my Instagram, you saw that. But this is going to be kind of fun to use and they're a little beat up, but again, like I said, that's how we save money is by not spending on brand new items. And just remember that it's temporary, kids outgrow things so quickly, and we like to be frugal with our money because the Lord's allotted a lot of us time here on earth, and I think our money is sometimes spent better elsewhere. Anyways, that's what I've got for the items that I currently have. I'll be having a baby shower this weekend too for things that we need and registered for, so maybe I'll have to do a baby shower haul. Comment below if you want to see that or thumbs this video up, of course, for thrifting and hand-me-downs and of course, little baby items. If you haven't subscribed yet, I would love having you join my community. I do videos on simple and thrifted living, DIYs and homemaking, and I would appreciate you hitting that big red button. All right, I will talk with you next video and I'm keeping it short and brief today. Have a great and wonderful day, bye.